it's just basically teams from every, universities all around the world, just um, students designing and building cars and then going to events all around the world and um, competing with them. We personally, we only go to one event in Silverstone, but if, um, if you have the funds, you can go to events all around the world in Germany, Austria, and even China. And um, yeah, you just design and build a car to compete against other universities. My name's Matthew Mamana and I'm the team leader of Formula Student uh, Team Sussex. So this year's um, competition is at Silverstone and the premise is that we have to design, um, and, uh, design build and compete a small single-seater uh, racing car that would be, say, bought for uh, a track day enthusiasts. So they have it on the back of their trailer and take it along on a track day weekend. My name's Alex, I am this year's Chief Engineer and I am also part of the Vehicle Integration team working with Matt Hamer on driver control. Well, I'm called Matthew Hamer, uh, so I'm the Head of Vehicle Integration. Uh, that's basically everything to do with packaging the car, making sure everything that needs to go on the car goes in, it fits well, um, keeping an eye on the weight management, keeping the centre of gravity low, and also looking at the balance of the car, so left and right, rear and front, just making sure that the, the, it's set up the way we need it to be for the driver to get the most out of the vehicle. So yeah, my um, role within this part of the team is to develop the driver controls for the vehicle. So that entails everything from steering through to the pedals to how we transmit that motion to the engine and the various parts of the car that need controlling. My name is Jack Campbell Brennan. Um, I'm head of chassis and suspension. And um, this is Adam. I'm, I'm in charge of doing the chassis. Um, well, on my part, I've got to um, like design the suspension geometry, um, and then how we're going to implement. Uh, we're going to use inboard suspension, so we need to get a push rod from the suspension to, from the wheel upright to a bell crank to the suspension. My role is to make the chassis, uh, so the chassis more or less controls every part of the car, um, everything connects to it, so you've got the engine, obviously the suspension, so that's why we work very closely, um, but all the components of the car will connect with the chassis. Um, this is actually the final design, which is going to go into the workshop, um, so as you can see there, it seats the driver quite nicely, and uh, the engine fits in there as well. Hi, my name's Dan, I'm doing the cooling system. Uh, my name is Evan Thomas and I'm working on the differential and also hopefully trying to customise the camshafts. My name's James, uh, I'm doing the engine mapping for the car issue. Um, well, without, well, I suppose without us it wouldn't, it wouldn't go anywhere. Yeah. Yeah. <laughs> so it's quite important. But yeah, and uh, obviously without the differential you won't have any drive to the wheels so the car won't go anywhere. Um, and uh, if I can successfully customise the, the, uh, the camshafts then we'll have um, much better performance on the track. Yeah, I think in the back of our minds we're all sort of hoping it just runs. We have yeah. set our sights a lot yeah. higher than that, you know, top five and everything else, but essentially we all just wanted to, run, to, to at least yeah. move. My name's Ashwin, I'm doing the brake steering and impact attenuator for 2013. Uh, last year I was just doing the impact attenuator, and um, so I'm just looking to move forward from the work we've done last year. I'm with uh, Exxon Mobil, who make uh, Mobil One lubricants. And uh, we've now been supporting this team for this is the fifth year, I think, that we've been involved. And the fifth year that I've been involved, I'm also an alumnus of the university. Uh, I, uh, my claim to fame here was that I got a degree in economics and I was president of the motorcycle club. And I've done really nothing with my life since then. But uh, until I got back into working with you guys and uh, helping the team along, or hoping to help the team, and providing a modicum of advice and some small pearls of wisdom along the way to try and uh, help the team get to where they are and also to introduce them to people that I know who I think might also be able to help the team such as Johnson Barry BC here. Johnson. Uh, my background is not um, Sussex University but Rupert bringing me in to help the team and again I'm going to echo a little bit of what Rupert mentioned and try to bring in the people that I know on board as well. But 
a part of what the team do is actually support Help for Heroes as well, which is, I think, is an amazing thing because I, I'm military and was injured in Iraq. So I know what it's like to have and support from many people and having the team support Help for Heroes is great. But on the other side, my support to them and try to motivate them to stay focused and work together as a team. And I'm hoping that would help them to win the competition. I'm very hopeful of the team and they seem to have the right work ethic and the right motivation mentality to, to get on and do well. It's nice to see something we've, we've worked on, we've designed all year, actually start up and move for the first time. Yes, and even more, that would be a bonus. And then, yeah, going around Silverstone and watching it race around the track is obviously pretty, pretty special. Thank you.